Laura Graves unbeaten at the Adequan Global Dressage Festival this year, including winning two World Cup qualifiers. Bronze medalist at the Rio Olympics, fourth in the freestyle with 85%. She's twice, as I say, broken 80% last season in Grand Prix at Wellington. She has to break 80% today. Yeah, absolutely. Has and, to. you know, Isabel's going to be feeling the pressure if she does. And here we go, 80%. Nice pirouette, keeping that activity. That pirouette was slightly more earthbound than the first one. Those marks keep ticking up, which means, of course, she's picking up 8.5s, 9s, 9.5s. Yeah, any mark at the moment that averages out at merely an 8 would drag that total we can see downwards. Super lift in that PF, that's looking incredible maintaining it into the pier it's just getting a little bit hot there as the test comes to an end so much power oh he was ready to hold a bit early good boy laura graves and verdades leading the american charge and charging into the lead here in Paris, no doubt about it. The question is merely what the score will be. Debuted a new, exciting, and incredibly difficult freestyle this spring in Wellington, Florida, as well. I was lucky enough to see it over there. Be incredibly interesting to see how it stacks up tomorrow against Europe's best. Did she break the 80%? I think she could have done. If she does. 81.413, that's the first time she's broken 80% in Europe outside of Wellington, Florida. 81.4 is the Grand Prix score. And just checking here very quickly, it is, I think, a new Grand Prix personal best as well for Laura Graves and Verdade. So what a place to do it.